Carla Compton, a hemodialysis nurse in Winnipeg, has just become the first person other than a progressive conservative to win an election in Tuxedo. Tonight, we have proven that there is no such thing as a safe PC seat in Manitoba. Yeah. Tuxedo has been PC territory since it was created in 1981. It's only been represented by two MLAs, both of them former Manitoba premiers, Gary Philman and Heather Stephenson. Stephenson resigned her seat earlier this year in the wake of a 2023 election defeat by Wab Canoe and his NDP. Compton credited her by-election win in part on the popular premier. What means so much to me is that for Carla Compton to win Tuxedo, it does send a serious message that this is one Manitoba. For the PCs, this is another electoral setback. Lawyer Lawrence Pinsky, the PC candidate, suggested he will run again. What do Ronald Reagan, Winston Churchill, Margaret Thatcher and Lawrence Pinsky have in common? We lost the first time. The tuxedo victory increases the NDP's majority in the Manitoba legislature to 35 seats. The PCs have 21, but only two in Winnipeg. The PCs face more political uncertainty over the next 10 months. They won't choose a permanent leader to succeed Stephenson until April 2025. Part of the Kivas, CBC News, Winnipeg.